And we've got intercoms. After the HDX 1100 is booted up, booted up fully, key switch off, leave the backup battery on. Okay. Just about there. Dynon Skyview. All right, Dynon Skyview, he said. All right. You switch off, leave backup battery on. Like no fuel tank. Okay, so uh, that was key switch off, leave the battery back up on, and select the left fuel tank. Verify left fuel pump runs. And we hear it running back there, so that means the ECU is active. And the fuel pressure comes up to about 3 bar, 43 psi. We're showing 40 today when the ECU turns off. So we're going to do a key switch off, and then we'll select the other tank and key switch back on. Okay, key switch back on. Caution. And Caution is, says our compass needs calibrated, which is true. Archer, Sierra 401, Charlie Juliet, climbing through 1,800. Okay. Fuel pressure comes up to about 40 on the right tank also. Verify right fuel pump runs, and okay, we got that. Right pressure, open the throttle about 10%. So we know, we're going to start on the right side, and I'll probably switch it over during the run. Okay. Everybody ready? Prop clear back in there? Look back there, Daryl. Nobody. Nobody. Okay, here we go.
around 800 RPM, that's good. And our fuel flow dropped to 2 gallons per hour. The alternator is not turning fast enough to make the ECU happy, so it's running off a battery instead of the alternator, which is okay. As soon as I give it a little bit of throttle, our battery terminal voltage will come up, and then once it gets to 13.4, that light will go back off. It'll be happy. So that's kind of an indication that the charging system works. We're draining 4 amps right now from, from the battery. Back to 1200. Okay, we didn't do too well squatching out engine noise. This, this message, cylinder head 2 and 4 are both high. And complaining that the right header contact is high, that's that. And the landing gear contact is high, that's, that's the landing brake brother. Okay, we're going to shut down here. Yeah. 
Hey brakes down there, I'm keeping my feet on the brakes for um, yeah. I think that's really smart. I think so too, I don't want to go flying through the garage. Okay, you ready? I'm recording. Alright, now stay on. Keep it on. Okay, boots up. Okay, we've got intercom again. We did. <laughs> Uh, Give me an audio sync. Clap your hands. Okay. Dine on Skyview. Dine on Skyview. Okay. Daryl tells me it's impossible to talk on the on the intercom with the mask on, but so far this is working okay. Well, I, I've had trouble. Well, I can understand. It better be muffled some. I don't think I don't think uh, power like that. Okay, let's see. You push off. Okay, okay. You push on. Fuel pump's running. Washing. Okay. Okay, key switch off. Okay, right tank selected. Fuel pump's running on the right side. <coughs> Got plenty of fuel pressure. 42 now instead of 40. Now we got somebody on the approach. Okay. Verify rate fuel pump runs. We did. Got good pressure. When the ECU turned off, we can crawl 10%. Thereabouts. Hey, great. Thanks for the information, and we will climb up to 7,500. You understand? 180 pounds. Key switch start for five seconds maximum, or until engine zero starts. Zero two, engine fails to start. Wait 15 seconds. Check the wrong position and try again. Play the prop. You're 